In this video, I'm going to teach you how to prepare a motion graphics template, or MOGR for short, to import in Titler Live. I'm assuming that you have already trimmed the composition down to as short as possible and added a pause marker. For more information on those important steps, please refer to my video on working with pause points in your After Effects compositions. Now open the Essential Graphics panel to start building your MOGR. First, you'll need to select a composition of interest. I'm going to work with Opening for this tutorial. I'll also add a name for our graphic, SDG Dialogs Opening. Now we can begin adding properties to Essential Graphics, and anything that we add can later be directly edited from the Titler Live interface. So let's start with the source text from the main title. Instead of the default text string, I'll rename it to something more understandable and generic, like title. If I want to be able to change the text color in Titler Live, I could add an animator, fill color, RGB. Now I can drag the fill color property into Essential Graphics. And again, I'll rename it to something that will help me identify it later, like text color. I like the original blue color, so I'll change it back for now. Since my background is a white solid, I can add the fill effect and drag the color property to Essential Graphics so it will become a color variable as well. Again, I will rename the property and set the color back to white. Finally, I'll add the logo, which is a nested composition, and the sticky note, which is a PNG image, as image variables by clicking on the layer name and dragging them into Essential Graphics. For example's sake, we can even take properties like the position of the image, although I don't imagine I'd want to change it for this graphic. Essential Graphics supports a really broad range of properties, and since this is After Effects' native method of generating motion graphics templates, you can find a lot of tutorials and documentation online, in case you want to take a deeper drive into the world of Mogerts. Now we'll go ahead and export our motion graphics template. I'll need to save the project first. Next, I'll be warned about fonts and other limitations of this particular design. Finally, I'll be prompted to choose a destination. By default, Adobe will use its local templates folder, but most likely you'll want to choose local drive so you can browse for a directory where you normally access your graphics for Titler Live. When this MOGRT is imported, you'll see my text field in addition to the designated image, position, and color variables in my live data panel. Text, image, color, and checkbox values in a MOGRT can also be linked to data controllers and modified while the graphic is on air. Other types of properties, like the position slider in this example, can only be changed before the graphic is live. Please see my video on modifying properties and linking data controllers for more information on working with live data in your After Effects graphics.